my name's Leonie and I'm doing the thought of the week today for Beastly. And I want to start off with a question. How much time are you spending with God lately? Because I found myself not really spending any time with him really. Um, it was really hard for me to, to, to pray and to talk to him and to read his word. I'm not sure why, but sometimes I just don't really feel like it. don't really have the motivation to do it. And, and, and I don't know about you, but you might feel the same that sometimes you know it's just you d yeah don't feel like it and it's uh, just really hard to do it um but this morning um i was just like all right i'm gonna give it a go anyways i, I didn't really expect much but yeah i thought i'm gonna read a psalm it was psalm 56 and i'm gonna read part of it it's the verses 9 to 13 i'm gonna read that then my enemies will turn back in the day when I call, call out to the Lord. This I know, that God is for me. In God, whose word I praise. In the Lord, whose word I praise. In God I trust. I shall not be afraid. What can man do to me? I must perform my vows to you, O God. I will render thank offerings to you. For you have delivered my soul from death, yes, my feet from falling, that I may walk before God in the light of life. And it was just such a beautiful reminder of, first of all, of like everything God has done for me. He's He saved me. He delivered my soul from death, like all the things he's done for me. And then also a reminder of that God is always for me and he always wants the best for me. And then it says, that was the key thing in verse 12 it says i must perform my verse to you oh god it just reminded me of that sometimes or most of the times actually we need to decide to praise him and we need to decide to talk to him and to spend time with him and there's there are going to be a lot of times where we don't feel like it and we we don't really feel like speaking to him and praising him, especially in the hard times, obviously. But it was just a reminder of that God is always the same, that he always, always wants the best for us. He always, he's always on our side. And he already, he has already done so much. And we, we just seem to forget sometimes all the things he's already done for us and that he's just worth praising always at all times. But a lot of the times it is a decision we need to make. It is, it's a habit we need to create. And um, yeah, I'm just trying that at the moment. I'm, I'm trying to spend more time with him, make it, making it a habit and make it a, making it a constant decision. We need to decide every day again to spend time with him and to praise him. So I think, yeah, that's my thought of the, thought of the week, the challenge for you to decide every day again to spend time with him and to talk to him and to invest in that relationship with him because that is all that matters. So I hope you have a good day and a blessed week. Bye.